Hey guys, how you doing? It's Finn Houghton from New Energy 21. Hope you're all doing all right. Hope you're all doing well this fine day. Uh, and every day is a fine day. Every hour is a fine hour, no matter what is going on in your life. Just remember, if it's a bad hour, a bad day, a bad month, you're here. You are. You're here. You're alive. You are a miracle. And every challenge that you have to face, there's a lesson behind it. People suffer more if they don't see the lessons in their challenges. The more challenges you have, the more lessons you will learn. And if you learn from those lessons, you will ascend. Your soul will ascend. If you just react to everything like and become a victim, then you're not learning. Uh, I was stuck in that trap for a long time until, until I started realising that things were coming to me to learn. Um, whether it was fear-based, whether it was judgment-based, whether it was other people, uh, the people that we're given in life to, you know, that we have to deal with all the time. Um, there's a lesson in all of it. So just so you know, if you're going through a tough time, going through a crap time, try and see the lesson in it. But that's not what I want to talk to you today. Um, for those of you, of you that know me, um, and there are a few of you um, as my subscribers, you'll know what I do. Um, I do hair analysis consultancy, so I measure people's hair. Uh, I do nutritional balancing and development for people, um, as well as bioresonance. Now, I put programs together for people, okay? And these, these programs are pretty comprehensive across their lives. And so sometimes I think there's maybe a bit too much information for people. And sometimes they can't uh, see the clarity, even though I do summarise stuff. And, and one point that I want to emphasise today is that there's one section that I always tell people to do. And I'm going to tell you it today because it's so important that it cannot be ignored. And it's really easy to do. It's free. And it's one of the most powerful things you can be doing as much as you want whenever you want and in this current time when money is tight not everyone can afford a hair analysis I get that not everyone can afford a program that we do not that it's that expensive but this is free and it's possibly the most powerful part of the advice now I often find people come to what I'm about to tell you when they've been doing what I've been doing for a few years, they've been taking supplements, getting their hair tested, change the diet, try to change the thinking. And then they come to this last. And I get that because as they start waking up, and, and what we do, by the way, with these nutritional programs does wake you up. It starts waking up your meridians slowly. You start gaining true clarity, true energy, energy like you've never felt before. So when those people start feeling that energy, this bit of advice is more relevant than it's ever been. And you can do it now. Now, this exercise is, I've been doing it for quite a long time, but I go in and out of it being favorable for me to do. I admit that sometimes I do it, sometimes I'll do a week without doing it. But recently I've thought of a different way of doing it. And I'm gonna teach you how to do it now. Now this exercise is called the pulling down exercise, okay? And it's all about your energy coming down your body. Now, I have made a video about this before, but I think it's super important to tell you the way I'm doing it now because it's really, really working for me. I've noticed a difference in how I'm talking, how I'm thinking. My creativity has switched, gone up a level. Not that I needed that. <laughs> I've had too much creativity anyway, but I noticed there was more clarity in my creativity. I found myself driving slower. And I found myself generally feeling cleaner energetically. So this exercise is the pulling down exercise. Now, a very simple way to feel it would just to be, do this with your hands now. And a bit of a Qigong movement. Up there, clap above your head and then push down. Now you'll find your feet tingling. Now that exercise is fine, it's good. If you've spent a lot of time on a computer, that's fine. I want to take it to a different level. And I'm hoping you can feel what I feel. 
Concentrating on your feet is also good of where you start getting tingling in your feet. But I want to take it a bit further than that. So here goes. Can you imagine what it feels like about one meter below your feet? Put your awareness one meter into the ground. And if you have to, you can imagine a pillar coming underneath your feet. You can imagine a bright white, what white light going into the ground by about a meter or two meters, like a pillar of light or even a concrete pillar or even a tree trunk, however you want to do it. Just imagine it's there. Put your awareness below your feet and what you'll start, what starts happening does to me anyway, and does to a lot of people I've spoken to, is you start getting real super tingling in your feet. And some of you might start getting a tingling here. What that's doing is it's moving your etheric energy through your body. It's coming in through the crown of your head for those of you that don't know, you do have a crown chakra, which opens and closes. What this is doing is it's cleaning your energy up. All the stuff that you've blocked up in the day. It's fresh energy coming in and going down through your feet. But I don't really want you to so much concentrate on your body. You'll feel sensations going through it. I want you to keep your focus two or three or four or five or six feet below your feet. Put your awareness below yourself. What that's doing is it's cleaning up your meridians. And it's refreshing your energy. It's giving you healing energy. Divine energy. And it's a really simple thing to do. When you're driving... I imagine I've got a rudder, like a boat. You know those rudder things? Boat hull is there. The rudder's there under the water. I imagine you've got a rudder when you're driving and I guarantee you'll slow down by about 10, 15 mile per hour. It's amazing. If you're in a meeting or you're just talking to family or friends, imagine you've got whatever you choose to visualise or just feel. You don't even have to visualise. Just feel below your feet and I guarantee what you'll be saying will be clearer less egoic that healing energy is clearing you out there are so many amazing benefits to it i cannot even begin to list them here but they are ma mainly well all of them are physical mental and spiritual so guys give it a go it's called the pulling down exercise again it was um invented i suppose not so much invented but specifically put out there by a friend of mine and a colleague dr lawrence wilson who i talk to regularly and um yeah he's got um some funky stuff going on like i have and so we both find it and as do our colleagues and friends find it very helpful to do this a lot of the time again i've gone in and out of it but Try and do it. Don't do it all the time, but try and do it as much as you can during the day. And I'd love to hear your experiences with it. I'd love to hear the differences you notice. Um, so that's it for today, guys. Not too long. I hope that was helpful. Um, if you like my video, smash like. Uh, if you really like the video, you can share it. I'm trying to build on my subscribers because I love you all so much. And I just want to talk and share wisdom with you all. I'll be doing some live um, webinars at some point as, as well. Um, so any questions you've got, any videos you want me to cover or a subject you want me to cover, happy to do it, happy to hook up with you all and uh, we'll go from there. But anyway, guys, I hope you have a fantastic day or evening where you are and I'll catch up with you soon. Bye for now.